Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge and we will be... And our live game is Real Madrid against Juventus. I'm Peter Drury, and this is Jim Beglin. Well, thank you very much, Mr Drury, and hello to everyone. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? Gareth Bale, for me, has got to be the, the standout man. Uh, renowned for his great pace, he also has a uh, crack. Casemiro is the guilty party there. It's Quadrado. Cristiano Ronaldo. Who's going to make this theirs? Tony Kroos. Goes wide. Marcelo gets into a good position. Well read, he sorted that out. He's going to have to tune his rangefinder before the next one. Casemiro. Shoots! Goal! Real Madrid! The movement so precise, the finish sumptuous. Real Madrid are such an adept counter-attacking team, they produce something out of nothing there. A few seconds was all it took for them to convert a defensive situation into a goal, and it's very impressive. Juventus didn't expect this, that's for sure. What can they do now? Well, we were unlikely to see a goal then because there were so many players crowding out that danger area. I think something very special was going to be needed. Matuidi pumps it upfield. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Quadrado. Pjanic goes long and forward. Now it's Higuain. Dybala with the ball through. Quadrado puts it into the middle. And he's there to hoof it away. Higuain. He's done very well to get to that. Well, I can only add that he's got reflexes that are in perfect working order, Peter. That was very good to watch. Spoon forward. Tony Kroos passes it through. Tony Kroos needed to come up with a better ball. Well, he simply failed to just put a little more oomph behind that. Looks like a good ball through. Keylor Navas gets it upfield. Pjanic showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. Now it's Benzema. Now the pass. Now it's Higuain. Tries a through ball. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Tony Kroos. Modric. Looks to slip it through. Aimed long and direct. That's good defence. Uh, plain and simple, good defence. They refuse to allow a turn. And it's Quadrado. Gone a long way up and away. And that'll be the last act of the first half. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. And the action is back on the way. Juventus need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution. And I think the more experienced players can oversee that. 
It's a loose ball. Strong challenge, but well within the laws. Marcelo pumps it forwards. Chance to shoot. Shapes to shoot. Pjanic hoops it upfield. Higuain with the ball through. There's no flag. Oh, that's neat. It's Higuain! Gonzalo Higuain! He is sensational! And the second half is off to a flyer! Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Juventus at the equaliser, and we're all square. Oh, look, Peter, I was on the fence before a ball was kicked, and uh, I still haven't moved. Katira, he'll hit it! And he's there to make a great save. Keeper has shown great concentration there. I think his anticipation pretty much did the trick for him. Attempt, just the wrong outcome. Well, when he struck that, he must have thought it was going in. Such are the margins of success and failure in this game. That was so close. Oh, that's great stuff from him. I would agree. Uh, it's tremendous play. He's full of belief and imagination and hard to contain. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo dashing forward at pace. Looks like a good ball through. Corner then. Real Madrid given another corner. Matuidi takes control of it and he's on the move. And he's made certain that won't get through. Looks to slip it through. Bale gets into some space. Tries a through ball. Thrust towards the front line. Now it's Benzema. Cut out in the nick of time. Quadrado. This defence is, is wary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight. Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Danger averted for now. Matuidi. Rafael Varane gets into the right position to intercept. Matuidi. It'll be a throw in. Douglas Costa. He's going to run down the left wing. And that's been repelled. Away from immediate danger. Out to the left it goes. He'll have a dip! Tony Kroos knocks it away. Aimed in towards the centre. Goal! Juventus! And the comeback is complete! A pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? And that's what the game is all about. Find space and finish, but we have to credit the pasta to pick him out. Well, for me, this was the obvious substitution. He'd become just a little jaded, and as a result of that, he was most likely to make a mistake. I think sometimes when the body becomes tired, the brain goes with it, and I think that's happened in this case. Juventus take the lead. Well, I think you can write this lot off at your peril. It's been a joy to watch them hold themselves right back into it. Now, can they hang on? Benzema, now the pass. Cristiano Ronaldo tries to cut back. Kadira tries to get it forward quickly. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo delivers a cross. Juventus just have to run down the clock. Kadira. 
Marcelo pumps it upfield. Benzema plays it out to the wing. A chance! Real Madrid could have here their final chance. And it's been taken short. Who's going to make this theirs? And that is that. What a match, what a comeback. That is how to respond to adversity. Truly deserving winners. What are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? They've achieved this away win thanks to a game plan which they stuck to and trusted from start to finish. The players deserve praise and, and so does the manager who got it spot on. And thanks to Jim, we both wish you a very good evening.